morning, everybody. For the past 32 years, actually even 33 years, let's make it 33, it. Dave Tabone has been the face of the music program at Bishop Bryan High School in Hamilton, right. but is hanging up that cap to focus on a, I don't know, something new. More and momentum going in a different direction. Yeah. Same direction, same theme, different uh, different platform. Yeah, so welcome back to it's a Bone uh, Academy of Music. We were here in September of 2020. Yeah. Okay, it seems like a long time ago. It was a long time ago, and I don't know how much things have improved. A little, right. bit, a little bit. We're getting, we're, 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 we're getting feeling close hopeful, there. aren't okay. we? Yeah. So you are officially retired, though. I am officially music retired. Team. Okay, so to focus on this. Yes. Okay? Absolutely. How does that feel, to be not well, in the music program, not... I mean, it's kind of good that it's, uh, I've retired during this time um, because of, we're not right in the middle of a crazy, uh, epic kind of gala concerts and touring and doing a lot of things that, because we often go to the States um, and we haven't had a chance to do that. So I feel like it's a good time. And now you have this. Yeah, so right? now I have this. This is my fun. This is my entertainment. Who do we got on the keys? That is Mr. Santiago Rosa. Santiago Rosa, Santiago. sounding good. Yeah, he's one of our right. teachers. He's actually a multi-talented guy. He um, teaches piano and uh, he does some drums for us awesome. as well. He's Who do we have in the room this morning? Good morning, we, everybody. Good morning, guys. Hello, friends. Who do we have with us today? We've got some parents. We've got some students, active students here at TAM right now. At uh, We call ourselves TAM, Tabone Academy of Music. Tam. So we have either students or parents. Awesome, okay, so what do you teach them? What, what, uh, we we what cover all the all the main instruments: uh, piano, voice, drums, uh, guitar, of course, bass, guitar, violin. Um, we're hoping to add brass and winds. Um, we haven't had a lot of interest in that yet, as, right. as because the programs in our schools are not working as actively as possible. So once I think kids start playing trumpet and viol uh, you know saxophone and stuff in the schools again, we'll get some people coming in for those. Yeah, what's it been like for kids not being able to pick up their instruments? Obviously, we're listening to a lot of music, but uh, we're not playing as much. It has not been fun, but I believe right. that he music heals, right? Yeah. And um, I think it's the one saving grace through the pandemic is that uh, students have been able to turn to music. Um, and it's been amazing. It's been amazing. So, so do you, how many different rooms do we have? We have eight up here, and we have a few downstairs. A few yeah. downstairs too. Yeah. So all kind of like little private coaching. Yeah, rooms, they're right? all they're all studios. This was a bank, so we actually literally have a bank vault. Maybe you'll see later on. Yeah, but it's, uh, so we can yeah. lock people up and. Uh, but we have nice big spaces so that we have double instruments so that the students aren't sharing with the teachers and stuff like that. And um, it, it's been it's been great. It's. You, you'll teach anybody? Somebody that doesn't we, know anything? We like, teach anybody. There's nobody who can't play. Yeah. It's like some people say, I can't sing. And I'll say, well, you can sing. You just may not sing well. <laughs> but um, yes, everything. We, we cover all the instruments. And uh, we cover all the bases. I, I think our youngest student is like three and a half, believe it or not. Mm -hmm. And then we move up to... Um, we have uh, a couple adults in their mid 70s, so early 80s. You're never, you're never, you're never too young, never too old. Absolutely. Right? To, to get into music. And a lot of um, adults are turning to this again because they've retired and they say, I want to start spending time in retirement and learning awesome. an instrument. Well, good to see you. Congratulations on your you. on your retirement Thanks, and, and to your new venture. We're going to be Thank spending so the morning much. here at uh, Tam to Bone uh, Academy of Music because you got the cafe still rocking. I got, got your cafe. wife involved. This is a family-run business. It's so we're a gonna, family we're, business. We're going to we're going to uh, we're going to meet everybody. So. Uh, Santiago, you want to turn it up as we go to break? Let's do it. All right, Santiago. Hey, morning, everybody. Welcome back to Tabone Academy of Music, or they call it TAM. In here with uh, Tyler, who's just shredding on the guitar along with his, <laughs> along with his instructor, uh, Chad. How are you doing, Chad? Hey, good, man. How are you? Awesome. Nice to meet you. Good yeah, you as well. Good job, yeah, man. man. Crushing it. So proud of you. Good job, man. Okay. Good job. So um, you can keep playing, Tyler, too. Yeah, yeah. We'll t we'll talk about Tyler while he while he's while he's playing. So you're an instructor here. I am. You know, so you know where's Dave? Dave kind of kicking around the corner. So Dave's right around the corner. So if we didn't meet him in the first, so Dave Tabone, 33 years at uh, Bishop Ryan High School in in Hamilton in That's the it. program. You actually went to Bishop Ryan. So the first time I met that legend was at 16 years old in 1999 when he came to Bishop Ryan after 10 years elsewhere. Um, I was in his first period class. And uh, he basically made me want to become a teacher. And now I have the honor and the privilege of spending the last five years of his career with him. 
uh, with my mentor at Bishop Bryan High School, uh, where I currently am taking the reins you're from there, him, I guess. You're back now, at your old somebody high retired in the so middle of the year. He's yeah. retiring and you're taking the reins. I'm taking the reins. And then you're still teaching, uh, you're still teaching here and at Tabone. I'm teaching two days a week here because I cannot say no to Dave Tabone. Yeah, Amazing. so uh, okay. it's, it's, it's a great to be a part of this journey uh, and to be able to carry the, uh, the legacy of, as you said in the opening segment, there are 33 years of, yeah. of music education. So carrying the reins for VR music and working one on one with students like Tyler. Now. So what's it like to work with uh, with Tyler? It's great. Yeah. So uh, any of our students to be able to work one on one is just a whole different vibe than uh, than classroom teaching. Uh, really quality instruction uh, happens on a, on a, on a one to one basis. Some of the stuff that you can't. Uh, you just can't do in a classroom setting. I mean, I've got 31 grade nines currently, and that's a big class. So you go from 31 kids, 30 kids, to having one-on-one -on -one half hour instruction with, with, with students is pretty fantastic. Grade nines. So you know, Tyler's a lot younger than that. Tyler, how old are you? Eight. So Tyler's eight. So where's the interest with kids in music and picking up an instrument? Wow, I think it starts, a lot of kids that I, that I meet, it starts at home, starts with parents, starts with families. I would say get your kids exposed to music as early as possible. I've seen kids play music as early as three years old, four years old, depending on the instrument. Uh, a lot of our students here start on piano, uh, just because it's the most accessible instrument for little hands. Uh, but I've had guitar students uh, as young as six, and uh, so I think it starts at home. And uh, is guitar your main thing for you? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm uh, most comfortable with the guitar. I teach uh, band instruments at school, so I run the concert band and soon to run the uh, the accomplished BR Expression after uh, after he's done it for the last 20 years, which is our vocal group at, uh, at the school as well. But uh, yeah, I teach uh, in terms of here. I teach uh, some guitar lessons and some vocal lessons as well. Awesome. And we're yeah. in. One of the one of the private rooms here at uh, here at Tam is actually an old uh, bank bank vault. But there's uh, how many different rooms, Dave? Eight. There's eight rooms all together. So let's 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 take another, let's take another break. Um, you can play us out, Ty. Yeah. What are we what are we playing it. What are we playing here? You want, you want to go back to Seven Nation Army? Seven Nation Army. Is that what you want to play? All right, go for it, buddy. Yeah, yeah, no, <laughs> keep them going, buddy. Keep it going. A little Seven Nation Army, White Stripes. Tyler's taking us to break. We'll be back at Tabone Academy of Music in Hamilton. Done, Jack. Good job, buddy. What's up, man? Nice to meet you. You want to say hi to everybody at home? Go for a second. Uh, hi. What you, what, so your name is Jack. How old are you, Jack? Yeah. Six. You're six. How yeah. long have you been playing the piano for, Jack? Uh, since I was five to now. And since you were five to now. Yeah. Wow, that's really cool. Welcome uh, welcome back to Tabone uh, Academy of Music here with uh, Dave Tabone. How cool is this to see little Jack here just uh, that's rocking it on the keys? I love his statement. I've been playing from five till now. <laughs> He's still playing right now as we're talking. He's he's got the music in him. Well, I was telling I was telling Jack off so camera amazing. because I have so I have three siblings at home, Jack, and I was growing up and all three of them played the piano and the keyboard and I didn't want to play. And you know what? I I regret it now because they're all musicians and I'm not. So, do you have any siblings? Uh yeah. Brothers or sisters? I have I have one sister. One sister. And uh and mom and dad. Nice. Do, does she play? Uh um my sister is uh she's only three so she's only three so, so not yet but you can teach her when she gets a little bit older yeah my dad my dad's a guitar player awesome that's yeah, so man. cool so he's so he's six started when he was five when's a good time for kids to start playing well you know what it, I, I often tell people that uh especially boys and piano they can start as young as four like yeah. you, you can be immersed in music um even in the cradle and, right. and so many people develop an aptitude just through their ears it's all about being exposed to music right, right? do you want to play again for us jack because we're we want to check out a few other rooms you want to yeah. keep playing for us Keep doing, keep doing that. We have we, well. uh, Louise. Is it Louise? Yeah. Louise. Louise is also one of the teachers. one of the one of the instructors too. Good stuff. Uh, good stuff, Jack. So, how many rooms all together? Here? Eight Dave? rooms. Eight rooms. Eight room. and, and a, a place in the basement too. A jam room. Awesome. Who do we got in? Who do we got in here? We got Abby, and hey, we guys. have um, Dylan. 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 What's on going the piano? on, guys? How you doing, guys? Good stuff. I'm doing awesome, man. So, so is it is it all private? It's all classes? face to face. Yep. We we don't have any group lessons yet. We can do that. We're considering offering that now that things have opened up. But right, right. now it's all solo. Right. What's it's this all, racket going on in here? This is some drumming. You know what they say about drummers? They what's like the, to make what's the most popular. By far, um, piano. 
then voice, and then guitar. But is the piano a good place to start? Is that like the roots of music? I've really always kind of heard that. The piano is, as um, Paul McCartney said, he looked at the piano and he said, everything happened here. Everything ever written was written started, right here started right on the here. piano. And I do, I'm a firm believer that that's your grassroots instrument. Yeah, You probably get a lot of people that, are, that like to sing and want to test it. We get a lot vocals. of singers. We get a lot of singers. Um, and that's the great thing about our stage is that they often come right from the classroom right to the stage and they get that development immediately. They get that feedback from the people sitting in the cafe area yeah. and that's the amazing thing. Well, it's got to be good now that you can have people back in here. Oh. You've been open for a couple of oh. years. You open in the pandemic, Absolutely. right? Where it's kind of open, close, open, close. Looks like we're, 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 we're going now, yes, right? Yes, 100%. And so if anybody interested, like, just reach oh, out to yeah, reach out yeah. To you guys. We're online, info at Tabone Academy of Music, or just search Tabone Music and it'll come up. Um, there's also a, quite a few links to me and my, uh, I guess, my connection to Bishop Ryan. Yeah, so, but so, you will find Tabone, you'll right. find Tabone Academy of Music. Okay, let's, let's go in one of these rooms just as we go to break because then the last segment we want to get into the cafe and we want, yeah. to, uh, we want to get on the stage because yes. the, the stage is important. Absolutely. So this is Abby and Dylan again. Dylan, you want to play us out? Play us out, bud. Go for it. Welcome back to Tabone Academy of Music. We didn't get Evelyn in last half hour, right. and we wanted to make sure we showed off uh, yes. her violin skills yes. in one of the private teaching rooms here at uh, here at TAM, which yep. is known as TAM. And we've, and we've met Dave, yep. Dave Tabone, but we haven't met Mary yet. Yeah. This is a really a, this, is a, this is a family run spot, it is. right? It so, is. And we know Dave just retired from the school board, yes, but, he you're, has. but you're you're connected to the school I'm board too. I'm still connected with the school board. I'm, I'm their arts facilitator, so I deal a lot with uh, students um, and music and arts and events and things like that. Yeah. So yeah, wonderful. The yeah. philosophy of this academy, though, is yep. is learning in the rooms yep. and then bringing it out 100%, here. 100%, yeah. Yeah, it's it's all about building their confidence when they're in the lessons and then bringing it out to the stage and showing it to the parents and their friends who are here. And they just, they build so much confidence and uh, it's wonderful. What do we have wonderful. on stage? So in stage are uh, VR students, so Bishop Ryan students. Um, a lot of them take lessons here. Uh, so we have Olivia and Rachel and Megan and Samantha and uh, they take drums, piano, vocal. So they're just, they're a huge part of Bishop Ryan, which has been a huge part of Dave, obviously, for 33 years. And now they're bringing it to our place and, and learning um, all about that. So, so what, yeah. does, what do you think being on stage with the lights and everything just, does? It, it just changes the way they feel about the music as well. And, and the confidence it builds in them is unbelievable. Uh, we have little ones that come in here and so shy, and then they're on stage, and then two weeks later, they're like a different child. So it's wonderful to see. We've been talking a lot about kids. Yeah. There's big kids out there right, too that right. have always wanted to learn an instrument their right, entire life. Right. And they're here too, and they're here too, and they're loving the using their brain and remembering and the music and the dexterity and all that stuff. So it's fabulous to see the older ones here too. And yeah, it's just it's such a great feeling when they leave and they're smiling. <laughs> so it's wonderful. Right. I said yeah. a family run business because your so your son's here too. Yeah, my son so, Joe's here. Hey Joe. Hey. Good morning, Joe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, the yeah. Cafe going yeah on we got the cafe. Why, why have the cafe? So for the parents. Uh, you know, sitting here and waiting for their, their student, to, their, their child to finish yeah. lessons. It's just nice. They can sit and have a coffee and a tea and a little snack or something like that. And they just feel like they're at home. Kind we introduced of. Joe. We didn't, so, we didn't get the so other. So this is Abby. She's also hey, one Abby. of our uh, music teachers here. And she helps us run the cafe. And Louise, a music teacher here as well. So, uh, yeah, it's just, it's such a great, it's such a great atmosphere, too. When you see everybody sitting there waiting, waiting for their child to finish lessons. And um, this little just guy enjoying Jack. it. Jack, he's so cute. Yeah, right, Look at him. And we yeah. saw popcorn they're loving the popcorn okay. so <laughs> anybody watching now this is just i don't know maybe it's a good way to build confidence in kids absolutely right? yeah and i think kids need that right now it's you know with you know the last couple of years it's been yeah. tough and it's it's really giving them a boost of yeah i can do yeah. this and, yeah great absolutely. seeing you guys again thank Tabone you academy of music i'll be quiet thank Dave, you you want to turn it up let's do it